5G provides super fast speed internet. To do this, it uses very high frequencies to send data, such frequencies that are not yet crowded. In order to send data at high frequencies, one handicap is that these high frequency signals do not travel long distances, so antennas have to be erected very close to each other for better reception. We are talking about antennas every 100 to 200 meters, which is exponentially more. What some environmental activists and scientists fear is that the radiation emitted by antennas would be harmful and intensified by the number of such antennas that would be required. Those for the 5G technology argue that very short range and short wavelength high frequency radiation used is non-ionizing. This means that it does not have enough energy to strip electrons from atoms, thereby creating ions. However, other research has not been promising. The World Health Organization's International Agency for Research on Cancer has also classified radiofrequency radiation, or RFR, as possibly carcinogenic to humans. And a study conducted by the US National Toxicology Program found clear evidence that exposure to cell phone RFR increased cancer and damaged DNA in rats and mice. 5G is the future. But the jury is out on whether we are compromising our health in the long run for extra fast internet speeds in the short. What is needed is open and frank discussions on the subject by all stakeholders. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.